So Frontrunner is about the rise and fall of Senator Gary Hart and the week that politics went tabloid. How much did you know about this story before being offered the role of Donna Rice? I did a lot of research. I tried to find as much information as I could on Donna from that time period. And mm. she was highly educated. And, you know, 30 years ago, she was portrayed as this one dimensional kind of caricature. And so I'm, I'm happy that with this film, she gets the voice 30 years later that she never had. So I have heard nothing but fabulous things about you. Everyone is like, oh my oh. God, he's the most amazing guy. He's oh, the he best comes to let actor. Down. <laughs> <laughs> and so interesting for you to play a guy who really was kind of made into being not such the nice guy. This is a interesting role for you to take on. What was that this like? This is unlike anything I have done. When you're playing someone who's alive, who's gonna see the movie, and you're depicting possibly the worst three weeks of their life, the stakes get even higher. And he was very warm. Yeah. incredibly intelligent and uh, he makes mean martini I can tell you. <laughs> Jason Reitman the director has called you his muse that's got to feel pretty great how do you feel about that yeah it's uh, it's great <laughs> I don't even remember what year his first movie was thank you for smoking but uh, I was supposedly a veteran but somehow he still seems like kind of a mentor to me how did you prepare for your role because you're a journalist and it was just so different back then Jason would send us every day on set like a um, an article like a page from like some newspaper and it's like oh this is how this is what's going on today in that in in 88 so that was like the most one of the most cool like little fascinating things but um a lot of it was just referring to Matt and Jay and just ask them like questions about being on the trail. So did he see the film yet? Yeah, he did. What do you think? Yeah. Have you heard any He feedback? was really complimentary about Vera, mm -hmm. who played his wife, and I think his main worry about the film was how his family were going to be depicted. Well, you guys did a fabulous job. Thank you. And they got the hair right, the Gary <laughs> Hart hair down like that. I don't know. I tried to live up to that hair. That <laughs> was the did. most haunting. <laughs>